You're watching CanadianProFighter.com. We're here at Montreal, just outside the Bell Center. We're here with Seth Petrozelli. Uh, what do you think of these big fights coming up tomorrow? Uh, all the fights I'm excited for. I mean, obviously the main event is the one I'm looking forward to the most. I'm a huge Machida fan. So obviously the last fight was a little controversial, but I'm hoping my boy Machida pulls it out this time, like hands down with no questions. Yeah, yeah, me too. I'm, I'm thinking he's going to win. I, have a, I thought he had the last one too, and I think he's the man. I, I, I th untouchable. Right. So what do you think about the, uh, the semi-main event? Uh, the which one's the summer? Paul, oh, Paul, Paul Daly, Josh Koscheck. Oh, winner gets the. Uh, there's, like, there's three of them that I know. Yeah, yeah. But yeah the, the winner gets JH St. Pierre. They're gonna do the Ultimate Fighter show. Yeah, the Ultimate Fighter show. You know, I'm I was a Koscheck fan for a, for a while, but did, and they're just so much crap talking between the two of them. I'm still think I'm pulling for Koscheck, but honestly, it, it can go either way in that fight, man. To tell you the truth, oh. but I'm hoping Koscheck will pull through. Yeah, I think it's just a matter of game plans. Yeah, exactly. uh, Koscheck sticks to his wrestling. There's not much Daly's going to do. And yeah, yeah, that's the thing. He has to stick to his wrestling, what he's good at, you know? Yeah, and he's amazing at it. And obviously the uh, big, uh, the other big card is uh, Kimbo, and he's fighting yeah. Matt Mitrione. I'm sure you have some interest in that one. Yeah, I mean, Mitrione is super, super confident in this fight. I've talked to him beforehand for, for a while, and he's he has no question in his mind that he's going to he's gonna knock Kimbo out. Um, I have all the confidence in him, too. Uh, one way I really hope that he does just you know, just to shut Kimball up again. But another way, I hope he doesn't, because then, then I'll still be the only guy that knocked him out, which would be kind of cool. And then hopefully Joe Silva will want me back a little faster than he does. So uh, we'll see what happens. But I'm pulling for Mitrione in this fight. He's a good guy, cool guy. You think he's actually going to shut him up if he knocks him out? Because he didn't, he didn't shut him up. You didn't shut him up, and you knocked him up pretty damn quick. Yeah, I know. No, I don't think anything is going to shut him up, to tell you the truth, man. He's just going to keep talking, running his mouth forever. So uh, how long do you think it's going to be before we see you back in the UFC fighting Kimbo? Um, I fly out the next day after this fight to go fight in England. Then I'm signed to fight again in August. I'm in an email correspondence with Joe Silva, the matchmaker. And uh, he's saying, you know, just, just hang in there. I want you back. I want you back. So I take that as win as many fights as I can, and then I'll have me back. So I'm hoping within six months you'll see me back in the UFC. Great. I mean, we've seen you do a lot of great things since you've been out of it. And, I mean, kicking some ass, looking good. Knocked out Kimbo, and he's here. Really? So, I mean, yeah, I... Really? I'd love to see you fight him at 205, heavyweight, whatever. So what do you think is going to be the, uh, the weight class you guys meet at? Um, I told Joe Silva that I would fight heavyweight or light heavyweight, either one. I'm, I walk around when I'm drinking and eating a lot at about 230, 233. And then normally I walk about 220 when I'm going to cut to 205. But I could stay heavy or I can go to 205 either way. Obviously, I met him at heavyweight last time, and I was only 205. Yeah. So I wouldn't mind going the opposite way and having him going down to light heavyweight, which would be kind of nice. Yeah, and he's only 225, so that's not a big uh, – today you just weighed in at 225, so it's not a big cut. I think it can be done. He, he, can, def he can definitely do it. He's just being a prima donna and not wanting to cut weight. <laughs> yeah, he, he, he tends to do that a little bit. All right, well, thanks a lot. We'll uh... – Make sure to see you soon. Oh, we look Thank forward to seeing you in the UFC.